Okay, so most of you probably know I'm a big fan of drones. I was one of the first people in the state to get like a Phantom 1. I was a very early adopter and uh, took some footage in Bali. I'll show you that uh, over, over there. <laughs> I'll leave a link. Uh, but let's have a look at uh, what's been happening uh, in Melbourne. Actually, you did like a uh, drone drone display for the, uh, the ship that came in. So let's have a look. Ship Queen Elizabeth had an amazing welcome in Melbourne early this morning after arriving from Adelaide. It was greeted by a light show created using drones. The 60 flying machines were controlled by a team of five operators who made a range of festive, maritime and wildlife formations. So that's pretty cool. So you got like a kangaroo that had a, uh, had like a um, reindeer and also had like the ship, ship's anchor, and, and the actual ship on the ocean as well, which looked really cool. Let's look at that one. Using drones. Sixty. That looked pretty cool because it had like the waves Flying as well. Flying machines were controlled by a team of five operators. I don't think they'd need five operators. I went to the um, Intel website. I'll just show you this. And because uh, I reckon Intel do the best shows. They're just like so cool. I think they did the uh, shows at the um, Beijing Olympics, but as you can see there, they, their shows are just magnificent. You can see the computer power that they use. I think they did a world record of two, I think it was 2018 uh, drones um, to celebrate 50 years of Intel. And uh, just so cool. I, I'm hoping, let's have a look at some of these. I can't probably probably can't show the videos because it'll be copyrighted, but um, just, just head to the website. I'll leave a link in the description. Um, I'm hoping I'm hoping they're going to incorporate them in this year's uh, Sydney fireworks. That would be really cool. That would be so cool if they'd start doing drone technology with the fireworks, because um, they've already got um, aviation restrictions during the fireworks as well. So you'd, you'd sort of think that they could incorporate the drones in with the fireworks and uh, keep them separated, but maybe have like a display. In front of uh, in front of the Sydney Harbour Bridge, I reckon that would be very very cool. Or maybe have multiple displays and have fireworks as well. So yeah, hopefully, hopefully fingers crossed. I'm right about this. But um, if they ha if they don't do it this year, I should suggest it to them because I reckon that'd be very 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 cool to have like a drone technology as well as fireworks. All right, guys. Hope you enjoyed that one. Uh, I'll see you next time. I'm I need to head down to my uh, parents' place as well at one stage to. Um, do the light display because they actually got voted best light display in Adelaide uh, Christmas lights so I'll, I'll I'll do some footage of that uh, just a house near near where my parents live and and it's uh, worth having a look at because it's a very cool display as well <laughs> okay guys Merry Christmas I'll see you soon cheers